this is our Zoe. Uh, it's the little sister of the Neo. Uh, we came up with the Zoe to have a smaller model in our collection, uh, which is compact, which is foldable for transport, which can fly for a longer time and at the same time is all weatherproof. It can still achieve large high wind gusts up to 35 knots. Uh, it has a large payload, so it can lift 6.5 kilos, which is, which is roughly 14 pounds of payload. So that's quite a lot for a X4 UAV. Yeah, that's why we came up with the zone. So with this video, we want to show you guys what's unique about our drone, uh, the Zoe. Um, we're gonna show you why we use different type of shape, different type of materials, and why we came up with this solution. Uh, we don't you produce these drones just for the looks. We do produce them to perform uh, and try to keep the design in combination with performance. We have a new design. Uh, our boom is quite unique. It's a complete hollow carbon fiber construction. It creates as well an airflow throughout the whole frame to cool all the electronics. Uh, on this model from the Zoe, we do also have uh, achieved to get away from the bolts on top, which normally holds the motor in place. We now have a different construction where we mount the motor on the bottom, uh, which allows us to have a more cleaner surface on the top, uh, which in the end is less bolts, means less weight, and as well, it's a stiffer construction. For the Zoe, we have two propeller options. Uh, it's standard, comes with a foldable propeller. Uh, we do have designed a new, more efficient and more silent prop. Uh, this is the silent prop. It has a new tip design. Uh, this tip design allows the prop to be really silent and it creates a cleaner airflow around the tip of the propeller, which in the end uh, results in less turbulence and less turbulence results in a more silent prop. We do have a quite unique shape in the boom. Uh, if you look to it, it's a, a shape of a raindrop. Uh, many people know that a raindrop is one of the most aerodynamic shapes uh, in, in, in world science. Um, what this does is uh, when the prop uh, spins, um, it creates an airflow. Uh, it sucks clean air from the top over the boom uh, and the boom will guide that air against the prop. So it creates that extra lift when the prop is spinning. It's the same principle when the aircraft takes off against the wind instead of with the wind. On the Zoe we do have an aluminium side bracket. Uh, we do have mul multiple mounting points on the side where we can mount for example a parachute safety system or components which need to be on the side of the craft. Uh, as well you can swap between retract landing gear and fixed landing gear. Um, it functions as uh, a heat sink as well. So all the critical electronics inside the centerpiece are positioned on the back of this bracket which then cools the electronics. On the back of the drone you can see the spoiler. Uh, we use this spoiler uh, to put all sensitive components uh, like compass, GPS uh, in it. Um, this spoiler functions as the lock for the battery. Um, so when you open uh, the dome or spoiler, you move it on top, you can position the batteries uh, underneath and lock the batteries by just a simple um, push on the spoiler and you're ready to go.